Residents of Washington, D.C. reflect on the horrors of the riot on January the 6th, 2021, while walking by a poop emoji statue in front of the U.S. Capitol. They found the statue satirical and a good way of reminding people what happened that day. Well, it's kind of a mystery, but there is a reference to uh, uh, defecating and urinating in, in these hollowed halls and that does seem satirical. So, I mean, it would be easy to read this as, uh, you know, as, as uh, you know, not coming from the right wing. But I, d I don't know. I mean, it's, it's a strange time we're in. You have to read the, the plaque that goes with it, I think. But um, I, think, I think I like it because it reminds people what happened four years ago. And it was really awful. And if it takes a pile of poop to remind people, then that's what it takes. I think it's important for, uh, you know, to, to ensure that people don't forget about that day. The statue does not identify its origin, but a National Park Service permit for the week-long stunt was filed by a group called Civic Crafted Limited Liability Company. Police said four people died. During the riot, thousands of supporters of then US President Donald Trump broke into the Capitol building in an attempt to overturn the results of the presidential election two months ago that saw Trump losing to Joe Biden. The statue was put up just ahead of the November 5th election, where Trump is running for presidency for a third time against Vice President Kamala Harris. Amid concerns over another unrest, some businesses in the American capital are boarding up and shielding their premises. I actually think it was a smart decision. Um, we all know what happens when things doesn't go Trump's way. Uh, he incites his followers to protest in violent ways, and I think it's smart. I actually work a couple of blocks down in a government building and I don't want to come to work on Tuesday. I think it's going to be hectic and crazy. I wish we would be off. It's a sad state for the democracy in the United States. Why should freedom have to re protect your own property when you don't disagree, when you disagree with somebody? It doesn't make any sense. You can't take it anymore. You're the worst vice president in history. Opinion polls show that Trump locked in a tight race with Harris. This is someone who is unstable, obsessed with revenge. And the seven swing states will once again be key to decide the winner.